Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Monmouth Regional is brought to you by Monmouth Medical Center in Long Branch. The Monmouth Regional Soccer Team hits the road looking to reach the 500 mark. It's the Falcons at St. John Vianney. The Lancers are back home after three straight road matches. In the first half, the Falcons on the attack. Robert Sherman takes on three defenders on the right wing. He's able to get the ball across the crease of the goal and onto the left foot of Anthony Cano. He had two goals and two helpers and a win over Point Pleasant Beach. At the half, it's the Falcons with a 1-0 lead. Just two minutes into the second, St. John Vianney awarded a penalty kick and it's Danny Herndon getting the call. Herndon delivers. We're all tied up at one apiece. Later in the second, the Lancers on the attack again. Kyle DeMarco with the shot. It's Herndon right out in front to pounce on the rebound and win the battle for the ball. Second goal of the game for Danny Herndon. He's fired up. St. John Vianney with two straight in the second to take a 2-1 lead. Monmouth Regional played with a sense of urgency, down a goal. Hakeem Joseph goes down, and the Falcons get a free kick. Monmouth turns to Anthony Cano from 24 yards out. The lefty strike doinks off the post and in. The Falcons have drawn even. Anthony Cano with his second of the game, and it's a beauty. Take another look. The woodwork is kind to Cano. Monmouth Regional has tied the match at two. Cano was looking for the hat trick and a game winner. This shot steered over the bar by Vianney keeper Matthew Brana. Through 80 minutes, no winner, so we're going to overtime. And 20 minutes of extra time could not produce a golden goal, so this match ends in a draw. 2 2 is your final. Herndon and Cano handle all of the scoring for their respective teams with two goals each. In Homedale, I'm Rich Crampanis for Jersey Sports Zone dot com.